Well, inflation certainly hurting all of us. It's something many of us haven't seen like this in our lifetime. Numbers out today show we hit another 40-year high in June, even worse than expected. Overall, consumer prices in June were up just over 9% compared to June of last year. And that means the average American household is spending almost $500 a month more, year over year, to buy the same goods and services. The biggest culprit has been gasoline. The pump price has risen a staggering 60% in the past year. Year, the cost of rent rose 5.6 percent, its biggest yearly jump in some 31 years. You know, people in some areas are feeling the pain especially hard, really struggling to make ends meet. CBS4 reporter Karen Morfitt spent the day in Kiowa, east of Denver. And Karen, people there have it even worse for several reasons. Well, Jim, a recent report actually looked at the differences in inflation and how it affects different areas. They found that expenses actually increase faster in rural areas, specifically when it comes to those fuel costs. And while the people we spoke with in Kiowa say they are feeling these increased costs, as the mayor put it, they just keep moving along, trying to keep life rolling. Thank you for calling Bino's Pizza. The phones at Bino's Pizza are rarely quiet and the tables often filled with locals. Every town needs a good pizza place, but we're the best. Jamie Polk owns the restaurant in Kiowa with her two brothers and parents. We're going on three years of ownership here. The pizza place here has been in town since um, I can remember. Her family plans to keep it that way, even as the cost of doing business goes up. From our pizza boxes to our pepperoni, um, we've seen the price increase tremendously. Pizza boxes right now are about triple what we used to pay for them. Looking at U.S. labor statistics, researchers at Iowa State University found that increased expenses combined with slower wage growth in rural areas cut disposable income in those areas by 33 percent. A lot of the wages are staying the same. Kiowa Mayor Rick Colm says location likely plays a role as well. Getting help and getting goods into town is often more expensive. It just costs us more to, to live. Gas prices at one time downtown were five fifty six for unleaded. Rather than let it shut the town down, some businesses have had to increase prices or adjust hours, trying to minimize the impact to those they serve. We have a pretty resilient community. Because Polk says it's the people that keep things running. They will never let a neighbor go without. They'll never ever let a business, you know, suffer. So we all tend to support each other in that way. And that is one of the biggest benefits. Now, that re the report also says that reduction in disposable income actually affects other parts of savings, like saving for retirement, saving for college funds, and that's where you start to see even more impact. If you'd like to take a closer look at the report we're talking to, we'll put a link online. You can find it at cbsnewscolorado.com. And if you're ever in Kiowa, Jim, we recommend Uncle Soli's Pizza. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. I'll take two slices, Karen. Thanks very much.